Good morning, brothers and sisters. Let's see. Today is July 1st. Uh, we've made it all the way to July. How incredible and crazy is that? As you can see, uh, maybe you can't see over my shoulder, uh, the beautiful sun is shining bright. Um, shining bright. And uh, let's see. Yes, beautiful skies smiling at me. Um, it looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. It looks like it's going to be a hot day. Um, so do what you need to do to stay cool. Um, so brothers and sisters, uh, in addition, today is, uh, July 1st, but today is also the, uh, the memorial, uh, the optional memorial of St. Junipero Serra, um, who has been in, in a sense in the news lately with his, um, statue being torn down, um, wrongly torn down. Um, while on the one hand, there's a whole lot of, uh, controversy and complication um, regarding all of that. When you look into his life, um, the very simple reality, well, there's a whole lot of complication around it, but the very simple reality is, say, St. Junipero, desiring souls to come to know Jesus Christ. Um, and that is, uh, that's the, that, that is the simplest way. And so that's, that's what he did. That was his life. Um, now there's a whole lot more to, to say on that, um, but this is morning prayer, liturgy of the hours. Um, and so we will begin that this morning with the invitatory. And so Lord, open my lips and my mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our maker. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great king over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our maker. For he is our God and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massah, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Forty years I endured that generation. I said they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship before the Lord our Maker. When breaks the day and dawn grows bright, Christ nearer seems the light of light. From us the shades that nighttime brings. Drive forth, O oh Lord, all darksome things. Earth's dusky veil is torn away, pierced by the sprinkling beams of day. Our life resumes its hues apace. As soon, soon as the day star shows his face, so thee, O Christ, alone we seek, with conscience pure and temper meek. With tears and chants we humbly pray that thou wouldst guide us through each day. For many a shade obscures each sense, which needs thy beams to purge it thence. Light of the morning star thy grace shed on from thy Shed on us from thy cloudless face. All laud to God the Father be. All praise eternal Son to thee. All glory as is ever met. To God the Holy Paraclete. Amen. O Lord, in your light we see light itself. 
Sin speaks to the sinner in the depths of his heart. There is no fear of God before his eyes. He so flatters himself in his mind that he knows not his guilt. In his mouth are mischief and deceit. All wisdom is gone. He plots the defeat of goodness as he lies on his bed. He has set his foot on evil ways. He clings to what is evil. Your love, O Lord, reaches to the heavens, your truth to the skies. Your justice is like God's mountain, your judgments like the deep. To both man and beast you give protection. O Lord, how precious is your love. My God, the sons of men find shelter in the find refuge in the shelter of your wings. They feast on the riches of your house. They drink from the stream of your delight. In you is the source of life, and in your light we see light. Keep on loving those who know you, doing justice for upright hearts. Let the foot of the proud not crush me, nor the hand of the wicked cast me out. See how the evil doers fall. Flung down they shall never arise. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, you are the source of unfailing light. Give us true knowledge of your mercy, so that we may renounce our pride and be filled with the riches of your house. O Lord, in your light we see light itself. O God, you are great and glorious. We marvel at your power. Strike up the instruments, a song to my God with timbrels. Chant to the Lord with cymbals. Sing to him a new song. Exalt and acclaim his name. A new hymn I will sing to my God. O Lord, you are great and glorious, wonderful in power and unsurpassable. Let your every creature serve you. For you spoke, and they were made. You sent forth your spirit, and they were created. No one can resist your word. The mountains to their bases and the seas are shaken. The rocks like wax melt before your glance. But to those who, are, who fear you, you are very merciful. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O God, you are great and glorious. We marvel at your power. Exalt in God's presence with hymns of praise. All peoples, clap your hands. Cry to God with shouts of joy. For the Lord the Most High we must fear, great King over all the earth. He subdues, people under, he subdues peoples under us and nations under our feet. Our inheritance, our glory is from him, given to Jacob out of love. He goes up with shouts of joy. The Lord goes up with trumpet blast. Sing praise for God, sing praise. Sing praise to our King, sing praise. God is King of all the earth, sing praise with all your skill. God is King over the nations, God reigns on his holy throne. The princes of the peoples are assembled with the people of Abraham's God. The rulers of the earth belong to God, to God who reigns over all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God, King of all peoples and all ages, it is your victory we celebrate as we sing with all the skill at our command. Help us always to overcome evil by good, that we may rejoice in your triumph forever. Exalt in God's presence with hymns of praise. A reading from the Book of Tobit. Do to no one what you yourself dislike. Give to the hungry some of your bread, and to the naked some of your clothing. Seek counsel from every wise man. At all times bless the Lord God, and ask him to make all your path straight and to grant success to all your endeavors and plans. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Incline my heart according to your will, O God. Incline my heart according to your will, O God. Speed my steps along your path according to your will, O God. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Incline my heart according to your will, O God. Show us your mercy, Lord. Remember your holy covenant. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Show us your mercy, Lord. Remember your holy covenant. Let us give thanks to Christ and offer him continual praise, for he sanctifies us and calls us his brothers. Lord, help your brothers to grow in holiness. With single-minded devotion, we dedicate the beginnings of this day to the honor of your resurrection. May we make the whole day pleasing to you by our works of holiness. Lord, help your brothers grow in holiness. As a sign of your love, you renew each day for the sake of our well-being and happiness. Renew us daily for the sake of your glory. Lord, help your brothers to grow in holiness. Teach us today to recognize your presence in all men, especially in the poor and in those who mourn. Lord, help your brothers to grow in holiness. Grant that we may live today in peace with all men, never rendering evil for evil. Lord, help your brothers to grow in holiness. And so, gathering these prayers and these praises, calling to mind now all of those intentions that we have in our hearts, all of those people that we've promised to pray for, all of those who have asked for our prayers. And so now, lifting them up now, calling them to mind, And so without those sacred words that Jesus himself taught us, together we pray, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God, our Savior, hear our morning prayer. Help us to follow the light and live the truth. In you, we have been born again as sons and daughters of light. May we be your witnesses before all the world. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Brothers and sisters, thank you for joining me for uh, morning prayer from the Liturgy of the Hours this morning. Um, I, uh, just as a, as a reminder, uh, next week, Monday, uh, I'm gone on, uh, on a little respite, a little vacation, um, and so we will not be having uh, this live stream uh, morning prayers. Again, I'm hoping to have, uh, to have that link uh, to iBravery posted each day for morning prayer so that you can at least go there and pray um, together but on your own. But um, we will be beginning back up uh, when I get back. So that should be hopefully Thursday morning, Thursday the 16th. I think it's the 16th. Um, I also might give myself a buffer day uh, to not get up early. 
so we'll see. <laughs> um, but uh, again, so Thursday the 16th, we should be back in action. So uh, again, uh, it looks beautiful out there. I'm expecting it to be super hot, so do what you need to do to stay cool. Um, but hoping that you are uh, have, a, have a great day today, that you are safe today. Remember to be healthy today, but above all, remember to be holy today. All right, brothers and sisters, may God be praised in you. May God be praised through you.